Hi guys, welcome back to a new Path of Champions video. Today we're going to be playing Path, and unusual because we normally do the Path videos on a Sunday. However, it was the big Path of Champions update uh, yesterday, quality of life update. So, um, Nasus had his uh, Shroomman preservation changed. So his, uh, enemies have all enemies have minus one attack uh, instead of granting the strongest one minus one at each round start. So I'm going to be curious to see, because a lot of people have been up in the air about how they feel about this so we're going to give it a try but before we do i do just want to speak about one thing we also got an update after the patch notes um that sharp sight is going to become a keyword now um my speculation is that i think one of the new champions that are coming in the the update in four weeks is going to have sharp sight base on their kit um i don't see a reason why they would do this um like, there's no reason to do this without something coming in the future so it would make sense um but yeah this is very powerful for one specific card which is kaiser kaiser on turn like for those that don't remember kaiser meta there was a bug when kaiser was released there was a bug where she would count sharp sight as a keyword and um yeah it's a it's not a bug anymore it's a natural thing and she was like s plus i think that was a tier zero deck back in the day um so I actually think that, uh, yeah, this is going to be meta again. So, I've already said what the video is going to be for tomorrow, but after that, we are playing Kaiser because I want to test how strong she is with the sharp sight change. But, um, yes, apart from that, that's just one of the things that got revealed afterwards. So, uh, let's return back to the game. And, uh, yeah, so we're going to be playing Nasus. The, the change for Nasus was his uh, star power, and the starting deck was that his uh, Bloodthirsty Marauder is a, a giant spell, so it's a 3-3, instead of the Sudded Leathers, which was a makes him a 4-2. But um, yeah, we're going to go in with the, the the Relics here, which I think are Nasus's best ones, which is give everyone uh, Overwhelm, because I'm fairly sure this is, yeah, it has to be a common. If it wasn't, if this wasn't a common, I think I would run this instead. Uh, all allies have Overwhelm, so all allies have Overwhelm. Um, maybe potentially, if I wanted to be really funny, I could do the like the 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 Nasus thing, um, where he strikes twice. But I don't have that currently unlocked. So for now, we're just gonna go overwhelm on him, and he's gonna strike. But yeah, we're gonna go into. Hmm, what do we do? Because I have a railing soul unlocked, but I I just don't think I don't think I can do that. So. We can either do Thresh or Galio. You know what? Let's do Galio. Let's go for a bit of a challenge. Um, and let's see how this goes. Because he's not three star, so I don't want to go straight into a Aurelian Soul. But yeah, we can we can give it a go here. So we might not get to the end, but let's see how he feels. So uh, game start, create two husks. Your created cards cost one less. Or when you play a spell, heal your Nexus one. Now, spell-wise, we have... Four, six in the deck. Uh, okay, the husks. Um, I don't know if they count as slays. Maybe they do. I think the husks are probably just going to be better anyway. Because they're going to make this survive even more. And then this card can get more slays. Um, so yeah, I think I'm going to do that because we don't create any cards. So yeah, we're going to go for common two husks start. And yeah, we'll, we'll see how we go in this run. So one of the good things about this is i always have to try and find healing um in the nasa deck because i just was struggling to find uh like survive long enough so i'm hoping that with the new update the uh the grind isn't going to be so bad mm, that's pretty good Approaching the battlefront. The so what we can do we can develop both of these then we can use uh, exhaust. Their bones will litter the desert. Um. Hmm. Let's uh. Well, we don't even trade with both of these now. Well, that's annoying. Uh, I guess we attack and then play this afterwards. I don't know if he can develop into something. So. But yeah, no. Nice. Uh, we can get some. Okay, trades there. That's new. You're provoking it. Okay. We got Siphon and Shrike. These get 
str not stronger, but uh, safer after every turn. So we can use this now. I don't think they use the scout, but we can just deal with it now. Um, can we we can get some blocks here? So this can block here. This can block here. This can block here. So with the minus one power here, it's really good because we got like a bit of a slow. This is the thing with Nasus, you always start slow. So uh Yeah, Nas, the Nexus. Oh yeah, grant your strongest ally, plus one plus one uh, for each unit you slayed this round. So yeah, that's good. Nasus is a 11-11 already. That that's very nice. Um and because we can play this, we can use these exhausts and get some decent trades. So we want to kill this. And we want to kill this. So we can go like this. This can go like this, this can go like this, and then the quick attack one can trade there. Okay, that's fine. The uh, thing is gonna grow yeah, three, and then Nasus is gonna come down and uh, instantly level. So allies, as an ally, enemies are gonna have a uh, minus two power now. And uh, if we had the sun disc, they would be a uh, minus four. So let's see what uh, what goes on here. I mean, we have lethal with a... Oh, no, this isn't... I actually thought we had overwhelm then, but uh, we don't. So, let's see. We need... What we can do, we can do this. And I guess Siphon Strike would have done the same thing. So, we Siphon Strike, and then we, uh, we finish the game. Having the uh, Tear of the Goddess... Such a such a very nice uh Look at this. Buff for uh the Nasus. There you go. So let's see if we can find a good supporting champion. Patience and fortitude outlast all things. Nasus the wise man. So let's see. Really bad spell, cost too much. This is like burst speed, summon a unit, but then we can also like try and find answers. Uh, and then this one's just really bad. Uh, yeah, I think we're gonna go for the trifecta. Okay, so because we play slow, the rule is I always try to find something with healing. So let's see. Sivar does not heal. But the quick attack is nice. But Sandra's always gonna start in our hand. Yep. Let's let's try Siv, right? Maybe we can look for stuff on the way. Okay, so the foes ephemeral units have well it'd be a plus one plus Well, technically it's plus two plus two, but as in like they're they're gonna lose a thing. Or we can go gold chest. Um that's always gonna be a heal, so we can either choose the shop or the gold. I'm gonna go for the shop. As I uh wanna try and get some powers, because powers, surprisingly, very strong. Um Sorry, I just need to check something. There we go. Uh, okay. So, we'll keep the, uh... There, there we go. Nice early units. We're gonna get the husks. Oh, I never checked if the, uh, the husks... Uh, count for this, so let's see. No. Don't. Double fading memories. Ah, yes. My favourite. Um, so I don't want to trade for no reason, so we'll just attack with the uh, elusive. So. We trade that with here. Uh, this can go here. I don't think 
I don't think we should have anything that we got there, and we can play this and then use the exhaust on this. Oh, never mind. Oh, never mind again. So yeah, lots of uh, making the enemy minus one. So, don't need to trade unnecessarily. One mana plus four. Pretty good value. I, uh, I'm a massive fan that the, uh, these Poros just don't do anything. If allies plus one plus one? Okay. Um, Interesting reaction. I'll make a note. Glory for redemption! Play this just in case. You never know. If we want to get blockers for these, I assume we're going to attack them both. They attack with everything. Okay. Uh, so, block, block. Block and block. To the block here, right? So, yeah, we're not in. Um, Nasus is not a big boy. Nasus is a small, little, stinky boy. But, um. Let's all play him. So, he can't block. Um, let's just do this, right? Because even if he blocks there, we get an extra damage here. Okay. So, yeah, we're doing a quite, quite well here. Um, we can play both of these. I think I'll cut these, given the chance. Uh, the healer. Just because I don't think it's a great card. So, yeah, we'll, uh, we'll see. Happens. Um, yeah, ideally, I want yeah the, to get to ten. That's my first choice. Um, yes, yeah, so we can play rock Sounds copper here. We block, block, block. Basically, everything survives because well, yeah, this is striking for ten. So this drops down an extra one. The expanse of eternity stretched out before me. Uh, it's very nice that it basically you, you don't get aggro down, so. Uh, we can play this. And if we get um trying to just get overwhelm on Siva. Guess that's the uh, the best thing, so everything can get overwhelmed. Okay. So let's see. Um, well, everything has quick attack anyway, so we'll go Challenger, because she already has Spell Shield. We're looking for that Overwhelm. There we go. And then since we've done that, let's buff this for an extra two. And we will basically guarantee you have a lethal. Sivot always goes to the bottom end. Uh... Uh, oh wait, I just realised we have Fearsome, so, so there's, uh, there's no need to pull. Oh, yep, yeah, there we go. Nice, easy thing. So we go to the shop, hopefully we get a decent power. Uh, maybe we can find a card that potentially we want to make, uh, put in. Um, I'm not a massive fan of buying cards. It's very rare that I'll do it, but you never know, there might be something. A one-cost siphoning strike. That is just too good to pass up. Okay. So we don't want this. Oh. Okay. You know what I said? I don't want to buy anything. I can't troll, right? So this is bad, so I'm re rolling. You summon an ally, give it challenger this round. That's better. Um, I will do a funny and I will buy one of these. Because it's, like I said, it's funny. Uh, okay, so healer, we want to cut a card. And yep, I think the card that we're cutting is um, Inner Sanctum. Just because if we don't get Reputation, it's three costs, and I don't want to pay three costs for that. So uh, yeah, if we can get one cost uh, Siphon and Strike and just eliminate the Zoe off the bat, that would be uh, that'd be pretty good. Um, let's see. 
Okay, so it's fleeting. Um... So we play this. Go get this tiny tower. Careful. So we do this first. And then it should play Zoe. And then we can cast that. That's very nice. I mean, for one mana. Kinda good, kinda good. So I'm not gonna, not gonna complain. Oh. Would you look at this place? They should have a second Zoe, I think. Oh no. Um. Find your own. Took it fair and square. I mean, we'll just play seven next turn. So we'll do this. Pretty good, uh, pretty good find. Yeah, I like my uh, turn four seven being a ten eight. Nothing's lost. It's just waiting to be found, and you won't believe what we found today. Sixteen damage. Oh, heal three. <laughs> oh, the one one serpent. Our times have changed. Uh, okay, let's do. That. Look what good comes of mortal greed. Uh, yeah. Challenger? Oh, huh? Enough. Uh, I mean, we're healing afterwards anyway, so we can just go for a good trade. I'm a woman of principle. Mine is kill and get paid. Kill and get paid. <laughs> So yeah, we can go for I think both of these. Yeah. Any trouble on your way in? Nothing I didn't like. We can look for good trades. So this can go here, this can go here. Fall to pieces. And he's basically falls to the silver as he dies. So yeah. So we, this can always get a good trade. Siva is now quite large, and if they attack with Zoe, we have Black Sand, so... Oh, perfect. What up, bitches? Bonk. Yeah, so, the constant minus one attack, it seems like the AI doesn't like attacking because of it. Um, like, it, I think it has another Zoe in hand, right? Like, they always start with two Zoes. So, yeah, it's a bit, um... I think it just shows that certain like AI opponents are coded to uh, like not play the Zoe. Like it played it at level one, but I swear it should have it two Zoes. What up, Zoe? Nice. Oh, clean Zoe. Push. This is going surprisingly well. I am. Um, Maybe I do. Maybe I can take this into Rail and Soul. As okay, so we heal eight. Uh, all right. So Nasus can get when I'm summoned, summon, summon an ephemeral copy, or we can make him have Fury. Uh, well, he basically has Fury anyway. And if we get a second one, he strikes two units, which that's pretty good. So let's get another one and give me an ice power. When you summon an ally, grant its keywords to uh, everything. The first time your Nexus would run out of health, heal it 30. I don't think this is going to happen. And allies have an extra thing. So I'm going to go for this. Because uh, I think this is better than this. Especially in this current matchup. Uh, okay, usually I would go this. But because we can, we, there's a spell chest, it'd be really funny if we can buff the uh, Siphon Strike again. If it, it, I think it'd be quite fun. Uh, don't need that right now. And I'll get rid of that, and I'll get rid of... I'll keep the Sivir, actually. Because I feel like if we get a Siphon Strike, we want to... play it straight away. Um, quick attack. Lucky. 
challenger. Um, do we do this? But at least quick attack doesn't go on a quick attack unit. We grant challenger to this. Actually, this is pretty good. So we do this. Do this, I guess. The, uh, this one. Take a look at this. So Evelyn had this, by the way, this exact thing, and she no longer has it. So, uh, be interesting to see. Our magic is dangerous. How, uh, oh wait, everything gets. Uh, it's pretty good. Okay, let's do that, and then we can Nothing trade here. And then everything's gonna get uh, overwhelmed once we play this. So, ooh. Yeah, let's do that. Sand and trouble far as the eye can see. Hmm, the joys of home. Okay, so let's look for good trades. Here can pull here. You can pull this, then attack, and it's never can pull here. Uh, Siva is going to grow big. And then we're going to get two Nasuses on the board, a Nasai. Summon, strike. And he summons another one, and he strikes. So. Yeah, we clear out the board. And, uh, yeah. The, um... Hold on a minute. I don't allow that. Just, uh, do this attack. <laughs> Not the unyielding spirit. Also, I just realized, because we have this, we can burst deep, give everything overwhelm, which is kind of funny. Patience and fortitude outlast all things. Okay, so... The only reason I took spell is because I want to try and get a buff for Siphon Strike. So, if I don't get one, I'm going to be very annoyed. Uh, Absolve what? Kind of crazy. I mean, I don't think it's going to do much with this deck. Oh! Manifest a card from our regions. I guess that's good. Okay. Do we want any of these... This could be okay, surprisingly. Wait, we get another husks? Okay, we'll do that, and then we'll buy two of these. Uh, yeah. So, item chest or soloist? We don't actually have the mana for soloist, so we're going to have to go down here. No, we won't get the best value, so just skip it completely. Uh, okay, we will take this, and then we'll just buy Kai Reaper, and then I guess it's gonna eat all of these buffs. So quick attack, challenger, spell shield, and challenger again. Um, yeah, so I guess we do this. So this one gets all the buffs. Well, this is the better unit to get all the buffs on anyway. And then we uh, play the Marauder. So this can kill this. This can kill this. Just clear off the board. Because we need to get these down anyway. So uh, Once we get Overwhelm... We can grant it to this, and this is going to constantly be growing, um, because we have the uh, this. So grant the strongest ally plus one plus one for each slay you've done. So we be slaying. Rock hop is pretty good. Scuttle guys. Then we just go for. Uh, board white. So, 
pull. Uh, this can go here, this can go here, this can go here, it's here. And then when we play Nasus, it's going to grant this Overwhelm. So they'll both be uh, quite large. It's just we got to get through everything. <laughs> oh, Siphonish, right? Oh, thank God for the uh, spell shield, eh? Get out of here. For oh, Barbara? That's pretty funny. I'm going to take this, though, because, um... This, uh... I think Revive is Summon. So, if Nasus somehow dies... Oh, wait, no, that's... Yeah, that's... When the Ephemeral one dies, the, um... We can cast that, and we can Revive... Anasus. I mean, I think the game's over. Gotta be honest. Um, wait, everything gets spell shield and uh, overwhelm. Seems pretty good. Yeah, Bakai Reaper. Good pull. I understand why it's not in the main copy of the deck, but um, yeah, good, good shop purchase. All right, so let's go to the item shop. What are we what are we offering my Nasosi? Uh yeah, right of the calling. Wait, right of the calling and draw a champion. So it's two champions for the price of one. Good. Shuffle two copies, plus three, plus three in ephemeral, or summon a preservarium. All these are quite bad, so I'm gonna re-roll. Uh plus three plus three, but I cost one more attack nab. Um, I guess I'll take the nab. It's not great though. Let's see if we can cut a card. Um, what do we not want? This absolver is probably not great. If I'm gonna be honest. Yeah, let's uh, let's get rid of the absolver. I don't think we're gonna need it in this. Okay, so Diego with Sovereign's domination. No power in this world can stop me. Okay, so we have the Siphon Shrike on one. Uh, so we want to save the uh, a one mana card. Okay, so let's see how many uh, different husks we get. So we seem to get the same ones. Tough. That's a new one. Regen. That's a good one. Fury. That's a good one. Quick attack. You know what? I will take that. That is four different husks. And we, we got some variation. So this unit is going to be pretty scary, actually. Especially because it's got regen and it has a 7 health. We ride as one. So it should play this unit afterwards. Oh, no. Don't, don't let me throw this away. No! We got trolled. Hey, that's pretty, uh, that's a good deck, uh, deck buff. Uh, so we want everything to have quick attack afterwards, so let's do this into, uh, there's no reason not to do this. We have regen, so we can stop the damage. Can we do this. And then, the best thing is, uh, everything is going to get, uh, spell shield. So even if you have an answer, we can, uh, Find it. Oh! I know. And we find that as well. <laughs> That's great. Oh! God damn. Perfect. Uh, so we will kill this. Uh, we will create hourglass, probably. Something tells me that you might have another uh, vengeance. That can't block. Uh, none of these have overwhelm, so I guess we just go. Well, we want to kill it, don't we? So uh, I guess Sif is doing the damage. Uh, but we're not killing them anyway, so let's just um, let's just do it like this. So then we get an extra two damage. Sif, what the trouble is? It's never too far. 
very nice. Exhaust, we have hourglass. <laughs> what did I say? What did I say? So we'll do that. Oh, we give everything spell shield doing this? And we have challenges so we can just pull to the side? Yeah. About that one, Viega. About that one. That's a pretty clean, uh, clean game. And that was the Viegos. That was supposed to be challenging. I think we just built a very strong deck. Um, yeah, the, uh, the minus one attack, it just, I feel like it does quite a lot. A lot of people say it's not good, but like, I would, okay, we got the, we got the good one. We literally got the good one. Yep. Yoink. I'll be taking that. One mana Nasus. Uh, when you damage the enemy next, just grant to the top ally plus one, grant the weakest plus one, or draw two. Um, I mean, they're all kind of big anyway, I'm not gonna lie. Uh, let's just go this. Uh, ooh, we do have some gold now, so instead of doing this, I feel like we Nasus is already pretty big. Let's go for some powers. Let, let's go explore the world. Spiderlings. Uh, right of calling, we have the, uh, the, the one mana Nasus. Okay. So everything's gonna get given to a uh, the Kai Reaper here. A double Nasus. Drain three. I mean, he's killing the one that is uh... there. The, the, the bad one. Um, you know what? Let's just play it. Let's just play it as a, uh... Because we got another one, so it's not... No, there is no way that happens like that. Oh, my God. Of course it does. Of course it does. Uh... Yeah, I, uh... So I can't use this, because if I draw a Nasus, he's just going to die. He'll just get discarded. Please play something. Oh, no. Salute. I mean, I'm not going to be honest. It ain't the end of the world. Seen tombs, towns, and everything in between. Let me just give you the good old bonk. The evolve unit? Hell yeah. Is that the bonk of 87? So we've got a 6-6 six, six coming down. Everything has... You Wait a minute. I kill that, and in killing that, the Nasus will strike. So ideally, I want to, uh, yeah, do this. Because uh, he'll come out and then kill this. And then I'm pretty sure the... So one comes out, strikes this, then it dies, and then the other one comes out. And then that dies as well, because this strikes? No. Ordering a bit different to how I thought it was. Okay. Um... We... Do we have the damage? We do. Nice. Life and death inexorably into one. Bonk. Put one mana Nasus. So, do we play Nasus on one again? No, let's not do that. Let's just play him for cheap on turn five. Um, 
Because we threw how many Siphon Strikes away there? That was an issue. Um, okay. I will have a Phage. Thank you. Alright, Soloist, give me something cool. When you summon a created ally... Wait, that works for Husks, right? Sure, I think it does. We're going to press it anyway. Oh, Spell Chest. We don't have enough mana for the shop. Alright, we're going to reroll one more time in hopes that we get the, uh, the bonk again. No! Alright, we're on Boomerang Blade. Boomerang Blade. Okay. So if I'm right, all of these husks should get plus two, plus two. If I am right. Oh, if I am, I'm playing this Nasus on a one, by the way. Just, just to let you guys know. Oh, <laughs> the first unit that we get then is a uh, eight attack and the twelve health. Oh, sorry, sorry, nine attack. Wait, so he should immediately level. The cycle begins new. <laughs> oh. You know what? Sometimes you do get some funny moments in this game. Turn one Nasus flip. Enemies have minus two. Off the bat. Yo, pickaxe cloud Cythria. She's doing it. <laughs> She's beginning to believe. The bonk of 87. Oh, we don't have a... We don't quite have Absolver yet. I mean, I don't think we need it because uh, we're already... Mahusive. No! Oh, the 2-4 the bird. Anything but the 2-4 bird. Yoink. Hey! Actually, pretty good. Wait. If I spend exactly 2 mana this turn... We can battle Fury next turn. And we are doing that. We put it in the deck for a reason. And we're going to get it off at least once. Okay, here we go. Oh, we get the Bonk of 87 as well. Yeah, invoke me the Serpent. Come on. Bonk! That was the Rickle Rex treatment. The one of Rickle Rex comes out to uh, each victory. clean the day. Okay, so Galio, we just need to clear the board. And if we get a turn one Nasus again, we just win. There, there is no hope for this man. Um, I guess we get this because it will always appear in the deck. Okay, cut a card. Um, yeah, I don't want Boomerang Blade. Get out of here. Okay. Let's see if we can take on Galio. Let's see if we can get a max... Sorry, a flipped uh, Nasus turn one. Uh, so we don't want this in hand. Pass. Senna. Ooh. Yikes. Not a fan of that one. Do we get spell shield on any of these? I might need it against this deck. Quick attack. Elusive. Okay. That's one too many bonks. What are you trying to do? What are you trying to do? I will not lie though, getting all three of them in the open hand is really bad. Um, I'm not even gonna let you keep that on board. I'm just gonna clear it. I'm just gonna go for a one shot later on. Because uh, we're struggling for a draw now, so unless we get the 
draw card. We're going to be a little rough. Um, Sivir. Sure. I guess Sivir's just With the power of time, the too good not to accept. You are a child. What do you know of nightmares? I know if I'm quick enough in a fight, I'll never have to meet him. Never have to meet him. Okay. Like this. So if we attack in the correct order, the uh, the civet should be leveling. We don't want them to have too much health on the units because um, Galio summons if they have 20. So just clear the board, and when they run out of their hand, we can probably hit them for the, uh, the full 50 HP. Probably with this, to be fair. Okay, so that's only 7. Oh, give everything overwhelm. But that is Challenger. The goal. Uh, right, let's just play both of these then. Would you look at this place? Yeah. They've got a ghost, a ghost of a chance. Last hey. night, Romay buys me a new sale. So we give everything, uh. The overwhelm. Which, that alone just means that uh, the Sivir can uh, just grant it to everyone. Uh, let's see, this can go here, this can go here, this can go here. We deal 30, well this survives, and we got good old Battle Fury to uh, finish it off, I think. They uh, have barely any health. Uh, this can really only kill this. So, go for it. Yeah, that's what I thought. Observe the price of mission. So, let's finish it off with a uh, big Rick or Rex attack. We'll drag at the end. We'll use a Battle Fury. We'll click the elusive. And uh, yeah, 72. Pretty, uh, pretty decent, eh? So, that was, um, not a lie, that was pretty simple. We did kind of like high roll with some of the, the stuff that we got. Um, but, yeah, I like the, I like the, minus, uh, the minus attack. It just means that you can survive in the early game, which is what this deck was really struggling with, in my opinion. Um, but, uh, yeah, the... Uh, got an S. We got it just short of my fastest time. Uh, full, he full health. Got all the gold. And, uh, yeah, I mean... It, it, it's just a very good thing. Like, we got the husks, then everything gets challenged, then everything's shared, then more husks, then all of the husks are plus two, plus two. Um, but yeah, I uh, I like this. Maybe, yeah, I'll give this a go in ASOL. Maybe it's not good enough for ASOL. But um, as someone who is relatively, like, not I'm not beginner, but I'm like in the middle stages now. Um, yeah, no, it's I, I feel like this is a necessary change for, for Nasus. So this gets a thumbs up. But um, yeah, that's all for this video today. So thank you everyone for watching. Uh, tomorrow is the... The wacky deck that I, uh, it's, it's, it's a gem deck. I'll give you a bit of a hint if I haven't already. And uh, yeah, thanks for watching and I'll see you tomorrow. Bye-bye.